most of the sneakers I got, <clears throat> I got on release day. Some of them I got after release day. Um, if you calculate the shipping and stuff, it's going to take a minute for me to do reviews. Fortunately, I work Saturday, so I can't really go to the mall and pick up anything. So I buy most of my stuff online. Alright, first shoe I'm on right in white, the Gym Red 13s. Size 7 13s run a little snug for me. So I get a size 7. And here they are. The Gym Reds. These joints are crazy. Sick. You got the reflector upper. Like most of the um 13s have. Bottoms. Um, pardon if you see a little dirt. I did the um on feet prior to the review. So if you see a little dirt, that's why. <clears throat> um The white insole with the red jump man crazy um the suede now let's talk about this suede i'm going crazy over the suede because the grade school 13s yo the material on the back and the side panels for the 13s is retarded like i don't understand why they can't just slap on a regular suede or new buck like it's always rough and frizzy and all that but this one right here they did their thing on this one like i love it it's nice and smooth look at that look at that crazy but um yeah gym red um i wound up getting these from dtlr they did a restock for the grade school the box look at the box grade school normally don't have a crazy box like they always forget grade school kids or whatever so when they have boxes like these i usually keep the box in different that they don't always put it in i keep the box so got the nike sign cement paper crazy matching the box okay okay jordan brand okay okay these are Raging Bull Fives. Crazy. The aisle sold is crazy. Nice and icy. Black panel. Red jump man. These started, so I'm glad that they starting to re-release old sneakers. So I'm able to cop, you know. Got the grade school version of the Raging Bulls. This is the type of material that they put on 13s, which is this is they could have done why I said it because I got scammed for these. Um, I seen somebody on Instagram getting their sneakers early, so I hit them up. I'm like, yo, you got a plug or whatever? Nowadays, you need a plug the way these sneakers be selling out and stuff. So I was like, you got a plug? Let me know. Like, what's up? So she put me on to this girl, right? I hit her up on Facebook. <clears throat> gonna wave popping. You see them wave? Nah, stop. Um, I hit up on Facebook uh, May 1st. Mind you, they were supposed to come out, I think, the 5th. That Saturday. So I hit her up. I'm like, yo, you got the Raging Bull Files? Alright, let me cop. She was like, yeah, they 215. Alright, cool. Gave her my information. Sent it through Cash App. She was like, um, this is a red flag right here. I should have known that she was a little scammer or whatever. She's a runner. She a track star. <laughs> Say like, nah, but um, she said it takes seven to ten business days to get your shoe, which is kind of crazy because if you're working for Nike, this is what she said she works for Nike, you should get her shoes early. If you work for Nike, like, why does it take you seven to ten business days to ship? Like, I don't where they do that at. I don't know, but anyway, the following week, I let it slide. No word. She was like, all right, I'm going to hit you up. I'm going to text you or whatever uh, when I ship it out. I'm like, all right, that's the day I, I sent her the money. Following week, I didn't hear nothing. The week after, I hit it up. I'm like, yo, mind you, this, this is like the 12th day, 13th day or whatever. I'm like, yo, hey, did you... um? ship them out when it comes to stuff like that when i buy stuff i know shit takes some time or whatever i don't like hounding people because i know people get busy or whatever 
So I let it slide to the two weeks after. Hit her up, like, yo, what's up? Did you sh um, ship it out yet? No response. So I go back to the girl who uh, referred me to her. And she was like, all right, let me hit her up. Because, you know, uh, let me see what's up. They go by two days later. No word. So I hit her up again. I'm like, yo, did you ever talk to the girl? She like, nah, I, I try to hit her up. Um, no response. Come to find out, she been taking people money over sneakers and not uh, uh, sending out the shoe or whatever. So luckily, you know, we got banks and everything. They, you know, issued me a refund or whatever through my bank. Got my money back, and I finally got the shoe. How I got these were, um, I bought these after the 13s. Yeah, I bought these after the 13s on DTLR. So when I found out they had a um, restock for the 13s, I bought it, and then I went back to see what else they had. They had these sitting, white jump man. They had these sitting with the um, Georgetown's 3s. I ain't really too much care for them, so I passed on that. <clears throat> so I want to get these, like I said, after the 13s. Boom. Raging both fives. Yeah, so be careful. You know, nowadays, with all this money, the stimulus checks and the income tax or whatever, people trying to be slick. So you be careful where you get your um, shoes from. Make sure they legit. You know, either wait for release date wait for these restocks or buy from a, a well-known source you know because these these people out here <laughs> but the next shoe up another pair of yeezys yeezys 380s you know what these are alien blues back see that crazy when i first seen these pictures online i was like yo i gotta have them like the funny thing is like i didn't like the 380s the only version of yeezys i liked was the 350 v2s but um i started seeing other um colorways on StockX and everything and i was like yo certain colorways is hot so when i get when i got the pair um Covalite, if you didn't see that video Go back and watch it. Do me a favor and go watch it. Like, subscribe, know all that. But um, after I got that pair, I seen how comfortable they were. So I was like, all right, you know. And then I seen these. I was like, yeah, I'm gonna, I'm gonna have to get these a pair. I had to get a pair. Um, they do have another version. It's called Alien. So I think the only difference is this. Also, is a different color, but the upper and stuff looks the same to me. But um, these are called alien blues. I think that's why they call them alien blues is because it is crazy. They are very comfortable. If you don't have a pair of Yeezys, get you a pair. You're missing out. Like I always looked at people when they first came out Yeezys. I'm like, yo, why are they getting your Yeezys? Like, what the fuck? And everybody kept saying like they comfortable. Like that boost. Technology, man, crazy. They do run small, so if you can't get a um, half size up, I always get my Yeezys in a size seven. I wear a six and a half, so I get a size seven, and they fit perfect. No room, not too snug, no extra room. It's perfect. Alien blues, get you a pair. A regular Jordan box, so I will be throwing this out, putting them in a clear container. These are. Ding, 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 Flint Gray Sevens, yo. I'm so glad they re released these bad boys right here. Look at that purple. Crazy. Crazy, crazy, crazy. Like, the first release was like back in, I want to say 2005, 2006. I think I was in like elementary, probably early middle school years. I remember when they released, I went to the mall. Like, ah, I'm go, I'm go to the mall. Go get me a pair. No, they was selling out. They sold out. I was like, what the hell? 
back then they was selling out which was crazy but these they actually sat crazy thing how i got these were on my phone again <laughs> on the phone chilling i'm on facebook and um hibbit pops up on my news feed these actually popped up under hibbit so i'm like you know sometimes you uh scroll and a, a website will say oh i got these type thing you click and you put your your, your size in the cart and be like oh out of stock like nah so i go on in I'm like, let me see this was a week later week after um they dropped <clears throat> say let me see so i go on in click my size and it went into the cart mind you they had like three sizes left including my size and for the men's they had a whole full size run right so i clicked and went in the car i was like oh okay so these are the first shoe i wound up getting or ordering or whatever and then i had a, a email for the restock for the 13s so i wound up buying that which was like a couple of days later or a week later and then i wound up getting the fives the fives yeah and then the Yeezys I got on a release date. <clears throat> so yeah, but the only thing, this is like, the material is like the same as every 7 for grade school. It's nothing really too special. The leather is crazy. You got the green leather. The green leather, you know. Tumble green leather, whatever. The inside, you got a black with the white jump. Um, the only thing that pissed me off, Jordan Brand. Come on now. This is the first seven I do not have. The mop the tips. Like, yo. Come on, Jordan Brand. You telling me you couldn't give me no damn tips? Like, that's the main reason why people buy sevens is for the silver tips. Like, sometimes they have different color tips like the gold or whatever. But most makes mainly they would have silver tips like all my sevens well, i have to do a video for my seven collection but all my sevens have tips like yo you wildin jordan brand you wildin like i don't get it like i don't understand when i unbox them when i seen it for the first time i'm like yo what the hell come on jordan brand really no tips you slacking i don't I don't want to hear you slacking. The way it's popping. Look at them things. You see sick yet? <laughs> Yo. This is a big ass box. Hey, Max 1, Kenny Griffin's the bulk colorway. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. You got the stock X thing tag. You already know that's coming off when I um undies them. This is a must cop colorway if you went to ken griffey the best colorway second to the cincinnati reds <laughs> they need to heavy up and drop those they need to heavy up and drop those cincinnati reds come first then these bad boys look at that look at that look at that Ooh -wee! lord have mercy i'm finally 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 so geeked that they um released these it's been a minute this is crazy i'm gonna have to find me an outfit you already know to go with these but you got the bulk i go true to size with these six and a half yeah make sure y'all like comment and subscribe i know some of y'all be um watching my videos but don't subscribe if you could do me a favor and subscribe to my channel um help me help you